and good morning to you, and welcome to another edition of ClinCheck Theater Thursday. I am your host, Dr. David Galler, and here with a quick little tidbit that you should understand. All right, sometimes we're working on a tooth that is just very worn down and cracked. Take a look at this canine. It might look like a primary canine, but it is not. That is actually an adult canine, and it's just very worn down and cracked. Now, in the Galler engine, remember, there is no technician involved. It is just a computer program reading the tooth and trying to align it. Now, when the tooth is fully beautiful like this with contours and mesial, distal and sizal edges, the system recognizes the tooth and is able to straighten it out very nicely and put it into the right spot. But when the system is given a tooth that is totally broken down and worn down, it gets confused. What's the mesial? What's the distal? What's the incisal edge? Where is the tooth actually located? And what it might do to a tooth is do something like this. It's basically very confused about the actual shape of the tooth because it thinks, hey, this must be the incisal edge and this must be, and the tooth is just on its side and this is really the incisal edge of the tooth and I'm really supposed to kind of make that part nice and flat across the top and obviously that's not what we want to do at all. That is not what the tooth is supposed to look like. So if you ever see a tooth that is very broken down and in your treatment plan, just understand that we're working without a technician here in the first round and the system itself might recognize it wrongly and do some weird stuff to the tooth. But you can kind of go in with some 3D controls or you could just tell the technician, hey, can you fix that for me and take a look at the new tooth. Just kind of grab a hold of that canine and I just kind of move it sort of right into the right spot like that. Just kind of move it right into the right spot. And I don't pick up this sort of weirdish angulation like that. I kind of got rid of the root torque, the crown angulation and the rotation, and the end result is good. So if ever you see a tooth that is very, very worn down, just understand that the system's probably going to glitch on it when it tries to align it. Thanks very much. This has been a Clinch Check Theater Thursday, and I am your host, Dr. David Galler.